Hi guys, welcome back to my channel Khaja Cooks and today I'm going to redeem myself by making the my spaghetti, my style again. The last time I made it, I made a big flop and I pressed pause by accident and stopped by accident. So a big part of the recipe was not included in the video so I couldn't upload it. So today I am going to finish it. <laughs> I promised you guys I'm going to show you how I make my spaghetti. Ne? So here I've got oil that I put in my pot and the heat is on medium to high heat. I just put like a little oil that covers the base of the pot. Ne? And I chopped up a, a large onion and a half a green pepper and um, three garlic cloves that I grated and I'm going to throw that in now. In goes the onion. And the green pepper. I like throwing in green pepper with any tomato based food. It just lends a nice flavor to it. And the garlic as well. I've used three freshly grated garlic cloves. Eh? I prefer using fresh garlic. If you don't have, you can use that's in a, um, a jar or something. And I've got two fresh chilies as well. Now my style of making spaghetti changed over the years. I used to throw in whole spices in here but not anymore i used to throw in stick cinnamon and all spice uh, so i one day i ran out of whole spices and i didn't throw it in and to me it actually tasted better without it but if you throw in your style and the way you make it you do that yeah, this is how i make mine now i prefer it like this you know guys i'm waiting for the pot to heat up i check now it was actually on low <laughs> Like I just cranked up the heat now, so I put it on on high now. <laughs> Ooh, yana, it is real milly vanilla. And now I'm gonna add a tiny bit of crushed chilies, like a teaspoon, or to your taste. As I always mention in my previous videos, my family likes a little bit of kick in their food. I don't make it that hot. Just a little bit in. Huh? Because we have the two old chilies in here already. Okay, so now I'm just going to let it go for a few minutes until the onions and the green pepper is cooked for the liquor cheese until it's lightly golden brown. And then I'll be adding my mince. Okay, it's been a few minutes. Here in my stir. And keep an eye on your pot no? when you do um, this stage. Keep an eye on you don't want the stage to burn. So now I'm going to add my mince. I'm going to add my mince. Just break it up a bit. Okay, and I'm going to cook that down for a minute or two. And I'll be right back. Okay, it's been a minute or two. I'm just going to check my mince. If, if it has browned nicely. Okay, now I'm going to add my salt and spices. Ne? Mm -hmm. 
So salt to taste. Okay. And I add a little bit of this with chicken brine masala. It just gives a nice flavor to it. I usually throw in about a tablespoon. I'm just touching by my eye. <laughs> It's what I want. It's just got a nice flavor, man. Oh, very nice flavor. And obviously, your black pepper, also a tablespoon. Move this a bit here. Layla, just come grind this paper over your man. I'm gonna take way too long. I'll tell you when to stop. You can stand there. My baby. Okay. okay, and while this is cooking here, at the back there, my pot is on already for my pasta. I fill the pot with, um, I like almost halfway full, with um, a tablespoon and a half of salt and a tablespoon or two of oil. Yeah? And I'm going to wait till it gets to a cooking point, a boiling point, then I'm going to add my pasta. And this is the pasta that I'm using. I love this brand. This is at Woolies. I love this brand a lot. It works for me. But you use whatever you have. So just on with the pot. Let it in. And I'll be right back. Okay, so my mince and all the spices have cooked together now. And the smell that I'm getting is just so nice. So, so nice. Yeah, man. So now I'm going to add my tomato paste. I've got this one here. I love using this one. <laughs> Sorry, man. <laughs> I use two of these. Ne? This I also get at Woolies. I like this one because it's just got a nice, a much more um, 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 redder and, and fuller taste that I like in my tomato base. So I'm just going to open this and add it in here. Okay, so both um, tomato paste tins, the content of it is in here. As you can see, can you see how nice and very red it is? I like how things it is. And I'm going to add so a tablespoon of butter. And so two tablespoons or a tiny dash of sugar. This I've learned as the years passed on a cooking channel that I watched in the cooking show. Helps with um, um, just balancing out the tomato, strong tomato flavor in here. Okay, that's my sauce. Here's some stuff still in here. I'm going to rinse this out and throw the liquid in here. Yes, we waste nothing. You see here. Throw it in there. Now I'll chuck the thing away. Let's 
See how liquor that sauce looks. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna, just going to check on my potty. If it's boiling already. If it is, then I'm going to add my pasta. So you follow the instructions. Boiling pasta, you follow the instructions on the packet. Eh? Everything is on there. But do not overcook your pasta. Overskit it over. Then you're going to sit with a soggy, soggy, lump pasta here. Yeah. That's why they tell you on the packet how long you must boil it. Eh? Another little black pepper. I do like my pepper. The smell so liquor guys so so nice all the ingredients that were in it okay so um my mince tomato base is almost done so I don't add any um Italian herbs in here it is a, a spaghetti um <laughs> Kaja Cape Malay style <laughs> spices and I'll be right back when I throw in the spaghetti. Ne? Okay, I'm just going to show you my pasta that's busy boiling here. You see the? This is what it's supposed to look like. I'm going to strain it and then I'm going to add it to my, my mince mix here. Okay, so the spaghetti I've added to my mince tomato base. The sauce, as you say, and I'm just going to give it a stir. Mix it through. You see the pasta is not very popular. No? That's not going to, um, I'm just not going to eat this piece here and taste. Mmm, liquor. Okay guys, so there's my spaghetti haja style. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this video as much as I did making it for you. And I hope you're going to give it a try. I know spaghetti is like a firm favorite in a lot of people's homes here. My children love this. Dipot and of a slut with. It's going to be finished. <laughs> there's not even going to be left over. <laughs> So guys, okay, I'll check you next time. No? Shukran for giving me another chance or allowing me to make for you it again. And I'll see you next time. Bye. Have a liquor day. Love you guys.